I think around 2014, we already knew, we had a better understanding of how we wanted to impact people at that, that point. Uh, and I think we knew that our vision was far greater than just getting computers to people. It's like we knew we weren't 100% satisfied with it, but there were other problems to focus on. Mm -hmm. But however, an opportunity arose uh, through some networking you did. I know you made connections with a, a marketing group, r, &R Partners, and they offered to support us in doing a brand redesign. So when that opportunity you know, came up, we definitely leaned into it because it was already something that was, it was on the, the list of things to do, so to speak. It was, and when we made the connection with r, &R Partners, who were so gracious and to providing all that pro bono marketing mm -hmm. uh, for us and you know coming up with a name way harder than uh, you would think it would be yeah <laughs> it took us forever I remember pacing going back and forth between the three different names and what fits our, our vision best and mm -hmm. you know it, it's actually an interesting exercise going through that uh, renaming because it really kind of forced you to sharpen your vision too mm -hmm. like we knew from the very beginning in 2012 that we wanted to do more than computers but we didn't know exactly how or what would best capture that vision yeah. And in a way, when we changed our name to Human IT, it was the catalyst that we needed to kind of get into the next service. We always knew that computers necessary, but without an internet connection, not sufficient. For us, and at that time we have a team, it's very important to make sure our sandbox is big. Mm -hmm. We want to do a lot of good in this world, and we didn't want to be limited mm -hmm. to what type of good we wanted to do. And we also don't want to rebrand every three years. So I remember that really being taxing to think about, okay, what, what can we do that's authentic to us, but really gives us a large space to play in and be creative because we didn't want to be limited in, in any way. And I think that's also what led to just human IT, right? Mm -hmm. It's something that we're going to define ourselves. Mm -hmm. um, it still narrows in on, on where we're really focusing. However, this can be expansive and this name allowed us to expand into that.